the secrets out, I ended up officially buying a truck. I talked about it for, God, probably a year to a year and a half. Uh, I wanted to get rid of my old car. I hated it. And I decided, decided a long time ago that I really wanted a truck for pretty much anything. I could do anything with it. I can tow, I can haul things around like firewood or pallets for summer shenanigans. And overall, it was just a better choice for me. Uh, some of the statistics on the truck, it's a Ford F-150, a 2004. It's a 5.4 liter V8 engine, which surprisingly gets better gas mileage than my 24 valve V6 on my Ford Escape. The F-150 averages about, I'd say 15 city, 20 highway where my escape averaged about 11 city, maybe 18 highway. So all in all, this is my much better investment for me, for school and just being able to, you know, have a better economic footing when it comes to having gas and even just working the truck. Things that are done to it. Um, I bought this truck used, obviously it's an 04. It has 86,792.6 miles. That's after I put about 150 miles on it. Um, as you can see, it has a aftermarket radio. I did not put that in. The people before me put that in. It's a lifesaver because I live in an area where I don't get very good cell service. So it's nice to have you know the ability to play my or play my uh, iPhone music. It has a Magnafolo exhaust on it, which when I bought the truck and just driving the truck, I'm like, oh, it's a truck, it's loud. I, you know, the only other truck I've really driven was our V10 work truck and my dad's GMC Sierra, uh, 2015 Sierra, which isn't loud at all. So I just thought, oh, it's a Ford, you know, an older Ford, it's just gonna be kind of loud. Well, in fact, it has an aftermarket exhaust, which sounds phenomenal. And I'll put a little clip in here. I know that when people see, you know, an update on a car or a truck, they expect a build list out of it. Um, I don't necessarily have that. I have a few things I want to do, but I don't have a specific set guideline for a build list and views, like video plans. One thing I want to do is I want to get the fronts, the front windows tint matched to the rear, just because it's kind of bright and the sun kind of gets in my eyes at certain times of the day and it's aggravating. So I think I might tin match the front to the rear. Um, probably a flagpole, just, I might, you know, get our rig one up just cause you know, holidays and flag days next week and 4th of July and just kind of, I don't know. I like to be different. Um, other things, uh, it has chrome wheels as you could probably see, but I think what I want to do is possibly at some point paint the wheels and then put a spacer on them to make them a little more flush and have a, just a hair poke, which would look a little bit better, I think. Down the road, I'd like to do a bigger wheel and tire, wheel and tire setup, but that's, like I said, far down the road, probably a year or two. Um, I don't know really what else. I would love to vinyl match the chrome bumpers to the paint color. I hate chrome. I don't know if I've mentioned in any other videos, chrome is just the most gaudy and dumb thing that I think could be on a vehicle. It drives me nuts. I'm not happy with chrome. So as sooner I can get rid of the chrome, I'm gonna get rid of the chrome. With the truck being as old as it is, I believe if I'm mathing quickly on the fly, it's a 13 year old truck. So it's an up north, you know, New York State truck. So it's gonna have some wear and tear, some rust on it, which it does. The wheel wells are quite gross. They're kind of starting to bubble and chip and, you know, not perfect. So that's one of the things I'm thinking about doing, not because I want to, but for the longevity of the truck. I think I'm gonna do fender flares on it and I'm just, grind out the part that's rusted and gross and try and put new ones on it and then have them vinyl matched as well just to add a little bit wider of a stance to it i think that might look a little bit better but 
we'll see. But other than that, nothing crazy. I don't plan on changing the color. I like the maroon, it's starting to grow on me. I don't plan on, you know, lifting it six inches and going insane as of right now. Maybe if, you know, down the road I come into some cash, I might, but realistically, it's an 04 truck. I was looking for something reliable. It has 100,000 miles, 100,000 less miles than my last car, which is phenomenal. So that's pretty much gonna be that. Um, yeah, so I hope you enjoy this little montage of the new truck, nothing special, literally just a truck. And I'm sure I'll get into some sort of shenanigans with it, but we'll see. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one.